What are you doing back there? I was tasting the soup. Well, stay away from that soup. Do something to help me. Hang these clean clothes on the line. And keep that fire going. Another cup, have you? What for? The tent's on fire. <laughs> oh! Oh! possessions are slowly getting less and less. No place to sleep and no food. What could be worse? Come on. Where we're going? Do I have to tell you everything? Not well, if you must know, we are going to humiliate ourselves by begging for food. What, again? Crank the car. and you'll be the head of the community play this year. Now, the scene opens in the country. And the old lady is seated in the chair, and in comes the villain with the mortgage. How about trying here for some food? That's not a bad idea. I'll see if there's any dogs. It's okay, there's no dogs. Come on.
pardon the intrusion, lady, but my friend and I are victims of the depression. We haven't tasted food for three whole days. Fancy not eating for three whole days. Yes, ma'am. Yesterday, today, and tomorrow. We were wondering if you would be kind enough to provide us with a piece of buttered toast. Oh, why, certainly. Would you mind throwing a piece of ham over that? Oh, don't you worry. I'll fix you something very nice. A thousand thanks. Is there some little thing we could do to repay you for your kindness? We're willing to work, you know. Oh, no, I, I think not. How about you chopping some wood? That would be splendid. Splendid it shall be. That's fine. I'll call you on a tray. Why did you have to suggest cutting wood? I didn't suggest it. You said to oh, the lady... Oh, shut up. Sweat. You make me sick. No, no, no! Well, you suggested it. Now you cut it. Well, I don't know anything about cutting wood. Well, you ought to. You once told me your father was in the lumber business. Well, I know he was, but it was only in a small way. What do you mean, small way? Well, he, he used to sell toothpicks. Well, go ahead and make some toothpicks. Be a chip off of the old block. Certainly nice of you. Oh, don't mention it. It's all right. Have a good time. Thank you. Your service. What do you want? Tut, tut, don't let us bandy words. I am here to foreclose the mortgage in your home and turn you into the street. So, James Finlayson, you thought to catch me unprepared and at your mercy. But this time, you are foiled. I am ready for this emergency. I am going to pay you. Then you can go. Go. 
and never darken my door again. something to help that old lady. I wish we could. One good turn deserves another. So do I neither. What do you mean, so do I neither? But well, don't you realize they're going to throw her into the streets? Well, what can we do? We've got to raise a hundred dollars. A hundred dollars? Yes. We couldn't even raise a thousand. No. We haven't got a dime. What are we going to do? I have it. What? An idea to raise the money. Let's go tell her. No, 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 what no, 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 no. We'll sneak out and not tell anyone. We'll surprise her. <laughs> now, don't you tell anyone where we're going to get the money. from being thrown into the streets. My friend and I are willing to sacrifice our all by offering this car to the highest bidder. Just what are you two fellas trying to do? We're trying to sell this car to raise $100 to keep a poor old lady from being thrown into the streets. Anybody will help a poor old lady. I'll give her a hundred dollars. That's the spirit, folks! I bid one hundred dollars! Have you got the time? One hundred dollars once! One hundred dollars twice! Huh? The third and last call! One twenty-five. I did. I was telling him the time. Oh. What's that? Where'd you get it? Now I see it all. What? What? Don't try to alibi. You know you stole this money from the old lady. Why, guilt is written all over you. What do you mean, guilt? I mean that you're going to give this money back and make a full confession. A confession of what? I think for all these years I've been fostering a common thief, a viper in my bosom. Who's but What are you talking Don't about? Don't try to bluff me. What? To think you would bite the hand that was feeding you. I didn't mean... You to... snake in the grass. You traitor. You sheep in wolf's clothing. You double-crosser. You, Judas! You, you! Stop! Don't call me a you, you! Miss me, didn't you? No, you don't. Get in that car! You'll go back and tell the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but... Thank you. 
Yes. Yes. He's the one who stole your money and left you at the mercy of that villain. Why, there must be some mistake. There's no mistake. It's all too true. Why, I caught him red-handed. There hasn't been any money stolen. We were just rehearsing a play for the community player. <laughs> I must have made a faux pas. <laughs> Oh, I have to wait, Mike! Wait, no! Get back! 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 Get back!